4 by 5 would be great, if only there were a way to make it simpler, hand-holdable, and fairly carryable. Maybe, just maybe, if there were a way to make it more like a point-and-shoot. Shooting 4 by 5 in a simple, light, easy camera with just a lens and a basic focus mechanism makes this format fun and accessible for any photographer who wants the resolution, but not the complexity and size of a monorail field or press camera. Distilling the photographic experience into something simple, effective, and useful, well, that's a shockingly hard prospect, and very few cameras do that well. In a world of over-engineered, high-complexity, nearly need a degree to understand it cameras, the Will Travel is a refreshing and welcome visitor. I wish that the will travel had been an option when I started large format work. I fumbled with a monstrous Calumet CC camera, the 400, 401, and 402. The 401 was, of course, my go-to because why carry a small 402 when I could lug around a two-foot-long monster that needed a 210mm lens to prevent the monorail from being in the bottom of the photo? In short order, I dropped those in favor of a speed graphic and a Super D, both of which were much better first cameras, but also themselves fraught with problems. Had the Will Travel been my first 4x5, I think I'd have less of an inclination toward the technical side of large format work, but a greater overall attraction to the use of sheet film. As a field camera user now, I missed the little Will Travel a bit and liked the quick snaps I could take with it. In taking away the time of setting up, choosing a lens, focusing precisely, and requiring only that I calculate the exposure details, the Will Travel gave me a faster workflow and made 4x5 more fun, more relaxing, and allowed me to worry more about the subject than the camera. And that, yeah, that was fantastic. <laughs>